Our destination this morning is You Dig Fossils, a private quarry 50 miles west of Delta, where people pay a fee to dig for 550 million year old trilobites. My uncle Robert Harris, he put a lease on this um, over 50 years ago on this state lease and it's been in our family ever since. There is an extremely high concentration of trilobites here. In fact, it's one of the better places in the world to be able to find trilobite fossils just because of the sheer number and how well they're fossilized. There's one right in front of you. Do you see it? Let's see if you can find it. Uh, oh yeah, got it. There, so I was looking that is, it's, it's, a great once, It is a really good specimen and you can see that you can kind of flake the rock off of it. That's an El Rathia king eye and it's the most common species we find here in the quarry. The way this works is this rock, since it's sedimentary, it cleaves. And so you can take a rock like this and pick it up on its edge and then we can uh, split it. See like this? And then as you go through it, look, there's the tail of one that's upside down. And here's one that we can just take out. And it's, it's upside down, so I'll take it out. This is the back of it we're looking at. And so when I take it out, see that? And there's the impression. Oh, it's so much fun. It's addicting. I don't want to stop. This is awesome. There's the back side of it, and there's the front side. It has the impression. There's the whole trilobite, and there's the impression. It's so cool. It's so amazing. Oh, my gosh. And what do they say? They're 500 million years old? Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing to me how many fossils there are and how easily they are found. The fossils range in length from an eighth of an inch up to two inches long. There's one right there. In just a few minutes, I've found five or six. You dig is closed for the winter, but their season opens next Friday, March 18. You can just drive out here. That's right. We have people here at the quarry, operators running it. And if you go to udigfossils.com, you can get directions and you can just come right on out here and we'll have someone here during our open hours and they'll take care of you. They give you tools as part of the entrance fee and uh, we just show you how to dig and uh, let you get after it and find your own trial bike. I would imagine this is a highlight for a lot of families, young kids and stuff like that. You know, I think people are a little surprised. We get a lot of people out here that say, oh, I just came out for my kids. But once they start digging, oh, yeah. they realize they have more fun than their kids because they're just trying to find a better one or a bigger one or a more complete one. It's somewhat addictive. You've got a nice one. That's a good one. They're worth almost double in the matrix as they are out if we're selling them to rock shops. So it's more valuable in the rock. I would leave it just like that. That's exactly what I would do. Yeah. And these trilobites, they would molt. You'll find ones with the heads just look like that and it doesn't have these free cheeks. And that would be the shell that it would leave behind. The ones with the rounded heads with the free cheeks like this, that's the actual trilobite that got, that got caught. So they're more valuable, actually. It's a lot of fun to see people's reviews. Like, we get Google reviews all the time, and, and people just love it out here. They do. Boy, if you have little kids that uh, like to rock hound, or even big kids like the ones behind me here, you dig fossils is a great place to bring them. I mean, I've been here 10, 15 minutes of digging, and I think I found a half a dozen specimens already. It's a great place, a great family outing, and uh, I'd encourage you to come out. It's, it's kind of fun, and it's pretty addicting as well.